Well, guess you can call it ironic that we had such rainy weather today during a solar farm dedication in Winchester. 60 acres worth of solar panels are now available for homes and businesses all over the state. ABC 36's Veronica Jean Seltzer reports some environmentalists believe it could be a way to bring new business to Kentucky coal communities. Even though it's raining, it is ironic. These panels are soaking up the sun. We're making a little bit of power. 16 energy cooperatives are celebrating their first ever solar farm. 60 acres, more than 32,000 panels. We have members who are specifically asking for solar energy. Now they'll have it. East Kentucky Power Cooperative's Nick Comer says for $460, a home or business can license one panel, reaping credits on their energy bill for 25 years. Comer says it would take about 25 to 30 panels to power the average Kentucky home. This is a very uh, affordable, reliable, competitive, renewable option for our members. So how do these panels turn sunlight into energy you can use? It's actually not that hard. These panels soak up the sun's rays. Then through a wiring system, it converts the power into the kind that's right for your home or business. Certainly it is uh, becoming a bigger part of the future. Kentucky Conservation Committee Director Lane Boldman agrees. She says teaching people to install solar is a great option to help coal communities find new light. It certainly provides uh, a new option for um, people who understand energy and still want to stay in that business. Boldman says there are already 1,500 solar jobs in Kentucky and more on the way. Can't say the same for coal jobs right now. Coal jobs have been on the decline for quite a while. Still, Boldman and Comer agree traditional energy sources like coal will never go away. Solar's current popularity is just part of a natural evolution. Reporting in Winchester, Veronica Jean Seltzer, ABC 36 News. In other news, a scam.